Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Quick general of reading for my friends Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Whenever you watch this, take what resonates and leave what doesn't. If you resonate, leave a comment, like, share and subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification bell. It seems to be helpful, so thank you for the support. If you don't resonate with the messages, they are probably meant for someone else. You will find other readings linked in the first comment. Feel free to check them out. And now guys, let's find out together what messages wanna come through for you. Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus in the Love Arena. Let's see. Two cards guys. And what a combination. Loyal Heart and Happy Happy. Beautiful opening for you guys. For those of you that uh, maybe are already sharing um, a connection that is meaningful uh, for you, that can fulfill your heart and soul, others of you um, have the desire, of course, to pursue an opportunity like this that can, that can be a source of happiness because you have the chance to meet someone that can be a fair partner able to um, vibe at the same frequencies of yours we cannot say no <laughs> to an opportunity like this and so guys let's see what the tarot has to say for you Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus, Loyal Heart, Happy Happy, let's see, here we go, Ace of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, Three of Wands, So as you may know, as you may know, <laughs> nine of pentacles, a single energy for the um, general meaning of the card. Very confident, beautiful in um, in her ability to channel and manifest her own satisfaction. You can be a man also. This is um, just the energy, of course. Someone that uh, doesn't need anything from anyone because the Nine of Pentacles has the ability to uh, be the primary source of the satisfaction um, that it's desired, basically. But it's still uh, an open energy, meaning that, as I was saying a couple of moments ago, the lady in the Nine of Pentacles is open to the opportunity of meeting a soulful partner, someone that can match her energies. And look at this. There is a sense of waiting. A soulful decision has been made because the man in the Three of Wands has gone through the process of the two of ones so now um, wishes have been thrown out into the universe there is a feeling about a fulfillment that can come in favor of this man in this case sun uh, to come up ships with a lot of uh, treasures coming in because also a truth maybe have been spoken ace of swords a uh, realization has been gained clarity has come in your favor guys this is a beautiful combination very high frequencies the ace of swords can be the clarity that um, you are able to channel a way of communicate uh, your goals, your aspirations, your your dreams also. Why not? Uh, in a very clear way, know, knowing uh, what to do 
and um, how to manifest your ultimate satisfaction also aiming to see manifested a loyal heart uh, connection beautiful energy for you guys now let's go and clarify the combination let's see what we can get Knight of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, beautiful, Three of Swords, Ace of Cups, bottom of the deck, I will keep it because it's meaningful, but I will put it here with the Loyal Heart, is the goal, so guys, Three of Swords, I cannot make circles about this energy, past disappointments, it's possible, but um, we know that um, this kind of experiences are part of the journey um, sometimes they are even um, able to teach meaningful lessons that otherwise uh, couldn't have been learned so it's possible that for some of you the high expectations that are coming out from the three of ones are also linked to past experiences where you couldn't find the Ace of Cups Loyal Heart uh, combination of energies basically and so you have learned how, you have learned how to recognize uh, the things that you want to see manifested in a love connection what can I say Nine of Pentacles clarified by the Nine of Pentacles you are brightest than ever because uh, you are full of confidence, you know your value, you can shine your brightest lights. People around you are perfectly able to recognize um, your aura when they see it. And then <laughs> I'm happy to notice that <laughs> the lady, allow me to say, or the uh, prince for uh, for you guys uh, watching can be reached by a beautiful Knight of Pentacles energy. Um, so indeed, a matching energies can be manifested in regards to um, very clear communication about feelings, Ace of Cups, about love, about the desire to see manifested a loyal heart connection. Maybe you will talk with someone. Um, you may know this person or not. This can be a future encounter. And there will be the chance to recognize someone that is trustworthy, reliable, honest that can be the older of the Ace of Pentacles that can move the 9 to the 10. It will be a, um, an honest uh, communication, an honest conversation about Ace of Cups, the desire for a love that is fair, fulfilling equal between those involved a source of happiness because loyalty yes is indeed uh, involved very different of course from um, a three of swords uh, possible experience but overall beautiful reading for you guys um, I am very curious to see where these energies are going. So for now, I will leave it at that. I truly hope it was helpful. I'll continue on Vimeo. I'll see you there if you want to join me. The link is below. Let us know if you resonate. Leave a comment, like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And until next time, I wish you all the best. Guys, take very good care of you. And I will talk to you soon. Bye.